Hello and welcome to Back of the Net. We've got a very special video for you today and this is our video to draw the winner of our Funnel Forecast fundraiser. And with me today I've got the man himself, Tony Funnel. Hi Tony. Hiya. Yeah, I'm good. I'm well. You? Good. Have you had a nice week? Yes, yeah, very good week and uh... I think I'm just about more, probably more excited than whoever's going to win this because they're going to have a brilliant day. And just fingers crossed, it's, it's you, whoever you are. Me? Whoever wins. Could be Could anyone, could be me. Isn't it? Could be you. I'm really excited as well. Uh, and um, I'm really you know, looking forward to, to seeing. I mean, Sam's going to work some magic for us later. Uh, and I think Sam hopefully is back there now as well. So, Sam, are you about? Hello. The magic of technology, hi, hi, look at that. How are you doing? How are you? Yeah, uh, I've just got to, before we get into the running order, talk about this shirt that we're seeing right in front of me. Mr. Tiggs, that's a beautiful piece of art. Thank you, buddy, yeah. This is my uh, All for Charity Mate shirt, so uh, I thought I'd pull this one out of the cupboard. It's, um, yeah, it is a bright one. It's, it's one that I do enjoy wearing, Yeah. If so, I had sunglasses, I'd put them on now. But I haven't got any. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, should be a warning. Can you put a warning on this video? Please wear sunglasses. <laughs> so, um, Mr. Tiggs, we we started this fundraiser really not knowing how much we could potentially earn. It's the first thing we've done um, through a back of the net, and I know we've got um, a fair few subscribers on YouTube and followers on Twitter and on Facebook and Instagram. It's all right, but. You just don't really know. And in a world where you log online to Facebook each and every day and there's someone raising money for some new charity, mm. it's very difficult to, you know, stand out, isn't it? But I think, you know, Tony Funnel helped and certainly um, what was on offer certainly helped. But also the charity itself, Forest Home, they are an incredible charity and their philosophy is to provide a welcoming, safe environment which makes excellent care available to people with serious illnesses. They, are, they also offer support to families and it's the end of life care and palliative care, uh, care. They're based in Paul and it's a charity close to Tony Funnel's heart. So, I mean, we started off thinking, what, what are we going to make? We didn't have a clue, did we? No, I must have... Go on, son, yeah. Well, I probably thought when I first said it, Two two hundred and fifty quids, mm. and then we sort of got up to five hundred. I thought, well, that's brilliant, and um, I thought it was great. I mean, everyone's donating to have a round of golf with Harry, but then secretly they probably really wanted a round of golf with me. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah, of course. So <laughs> um, yeah, no. All joking aside, it, it's been brilliant, and, and I don't myself. I don't even know how much we've reached. I haven't looked for a couple of days. No, I mean, is that something, Sam? You think we could do a reveal now of how much money we've managed to raise? Let's do it. So this is a live view of the Just Giving page here, and as you can see here, one hundred and thirteen percent. We went for two grand, two thousand two hundred and sixty-six pounds raised by one hundred and eleven supporters. I mean, that is fantastic. Give yourselves a it's big amazing. round of applause. That's amazing, isn't it, Tony? Yeah, brilliant. And, and yeah, delighted, Tony. And well, that, that that money will go to really good use, won't it? Yeah, the charity really needs it. And um, I just hope that um, someone is looking forward to winning because we can't be far off for our big draw. We're pretty close. And what do they win? Well, they win. Um, I'll, I'll go in reverse order this time, guys. So I'll go to the back of the net merchandise, which is going to be a coaster bottle opener, which is very sought after. Uh, looks like that. What and a if thing of beauty, isn't it? No one's won it yet. No one's won one of these things, and we, and we do it every week. We've got a £20 gift voucher for the AFC Bournemouth Superstore. We've got £50 to spend in the Rope and Anchor in Pool, which is a fantastic place with fantastic food. Sam, you were there last week, weren't you? Yeah, it was. It's um, run by Cherry's fans, um, really, really top people that run it, and a friendly place if you want to have a meal or a drink. But the mega prize, Tony. Whoa, Tony Funnel. Tell us who, who's there with you, buddy. Well, I don't know if Many people will know him. It's Harry Redknapp, his name is. Uh, but I don't worry about that because you'll be playing golf with me. <laughs> don't worry about Harry. <laughs> no, all joking aside, it's amazing because 
since Harry's put his name to it and said he's going to come and play golf and have lunch with us, I mean, it's skyrocketed. It's um, it's gone into a different level. So really pleased. And uh, thanks to Harry to um, saying he'll come along. Yeah, thanks to Harry. Yeah, really lovely of him. Um, so, Sam, how are we going to do this? How does this work? Have you got a hat or something or something magical out <laughs> there? It's all done online. Right. So basically what we said, of course, um, was every two pounds was an entry to the competition. Um, but people donated big amounts. So basically we've got all the entries in a spreadsheet. Um, now, there were a number of people that donated um, anonymously. We con Well, we tried to contact them, um, but of course, those will not be drawn because we don't know who they are. We've also had a number of people, a significant amount of people that have donated with not really wanting to win the prize, just to donate. So with transparency being uh, a word of the day, the, we've got a massive, great big spreadsheet here, Mr. Tiggs. It's huge. Oh, yeah. And, yeah, and these are all of the people that are in the draw, and I've got all the names here, and I'm going through. I mean, look at these amazing people um, and amazing companies. Uh, friends of Pokesdown, James Rude there, Ken Shiverton, Leanne Chetwin, thank you very much, Lynn Cook, Margaret, uh, Neil Whedon, Nick Jenkins, Nobby Dog, Paul Payne. Phil, I mean, we could go on for a long time. Russ and Angie Chetwin there, Stuart Plumridge, Tim Clark, uh, Tony Redding, Vicky Burrows, James McCaffrey, Ryan Lucas, Mark Jack. I mean, thank you all, Steve Hensman as well, who's been on the podcast. An unbelievable array of people, and you know, thank you so much to each and every one of you that has uh, you know taken part. So yeah, what we are doing is we're going to copy all of those names out, and we're going to paste them into a special website, which I'm going to bring up on the screen now, and it's called Random Name Picker. You should see it <laughs> on screen in front of you now. So, of course, what we've done is we've worked out the appropriate amount of entries per person. So, obviously, if you donate more money, there's more chance of winning. And all we're going to do here is paste in the names like so. There they are. Those are all the names. Uh, we're going to not filter the duplicate names. So there we go. Um, a fantastic number of entries there. And then it's just a case of me clicking this big white button. We have not done this as a test. We have not done a mock. This is it. This is it. Um, I should build some tension, shouldn't I? Have, have you got some background music? Hang on. There it is. The Who Wants to Be a Millionaire music. This is like the million pound question, isn't it? But let's now press the button and see what and whose name it lands on. Here we go. And the winner is Chris Root is the winner. Congratulations, Chris. Mate, you have won the prize and you have won a round of golf with this man here, Tony Funnel and Harry Redknapp. The £50 rope and anchor voucher is yours. Of course, you win the Superstore voucher, but come on. Is this you're excited about, right? <laughs> we back a little bit, bottle open it as well. The first one that's been produced, and it's Chris Root that is the winner. And not only that, Tony Funnel, it's not just the round of golf. He gets to have lunch with you both as well. Is that right? Yeah, they'll have lunch and a chat afterwards. Honestly, we'll have a brilliant day because I'm sure Harry won't start talking all the way around. He might, he just might have a few little stories. Oh, I bet he does, yeah. <laughs> Do we know? Does anyone know Chris Root? I well, I know that he's on Twitter. I know that he's on Twitter, oh. and you know what? Wouldn't it be great if we could get a live reaction? Wouldn't it be great? Yeah, yeah. But yeah. I might see if I can get his phone number. Okay, so with the power of video editing, um, I've basically managed to take time out and I have got his phone number, right? Because he's on our Twitter. He's actually been a listener of the podcast for a long time. Um, he's been listening since the very beginning because I've seen a few emails that I've received from him. And in fact, when we did a back of the net awards after the very first season, we did a podcast. We did like player of the season, most improved player, uh, youngest player, best goal, best stadium experience, etc. He was one of the people that put in a vote. So anyway, I sent him a DM on Twitter, said, uh, Chris, we, we want to get your opinion on the podcast because we're getting some thoughts. So 
is all right if I give you a call. He's given me his number. So by the power of the telephone, I can give him a call. I just really hope this works. Hello? Is that Chris? Yeah. Oh, hi, Chris. It's um, Sam Davis from Back of the Net here. Oh, hey, man. How are you doing? Are you all right? Yeah, not too bad, thanks. Cool, cool. Um, thank you for giving me your number to get in touch. Um, I told a little bit of a cheeky lie on the message, only your name has been drawn as the winner of the competition to win a round of golf with Harry Redknapp and Tony Funnel. Oh, wow. Yeah, <laughs> we did... We did the draw earlier today. So yeah, you've won the um, the £50 rope and anchor voucher, the Superstore voucher, the bottle opener, which I'm sure you're going to be well excited about. <laughs> wow. <laughs> no, that's really cool. No worries at all, buddy. I donated the other day because you put that on Twitter and I thought, yeah, I'll, I'll chuck some money in. Oh, that's really good, I think. You've, you've developed yourself a nice little fan base. Oh, good stuff, yeah. yeah. Good job. I'll, I'll keep listening, so... <laughs> Good man. Keep a tick next to my name. Yeah, good man. All right, buddy. Well, thanks very much. And uh, I'll send you a message on um, on Twitter a bit later, if that's okay. Yeah, yeah, no worries. Thank you very much. Nice one. All right, I'll speak to you soon. Cheers, Chris. Okay. Yeah, cheers. Okay, thanks. Bye-bye. Bye. <laughs> Brilliant. Well, amazing. Tony Funnel, uh, amazing. We've got our winner. What do you think about that? Excellent. I'm really pleased for him. Um, he's going to have a lovely day. We'll have a great round of golf. We'll have a chat and laughs all the way around. Plenty of stories from Harry and a nice lunch afterwards and another chat. Brilliant. Uh, uh, how good are you at golf, Tone? Uh, I wouldn't say I'm great, but I'm getting better. Okay, good. good. I try hard. Try hard. Well, that's I all. Try it's, hard, yeah. it's not about the golf, is it? It's about the fun. No, it's about the day. And he'll it, it, have the best day he's ever had. He'll have, a brilliant, honestly, he'll have a brilliant day well should i say he'll have the best days golf he's ever had yeah, that's better <laughs> that's better that's but, fantastic can i also thank everyone that uh, took part everyone who donated everyone who forwarded because it all helps you know people think oh i didn't know i couldn't afford to donate but if they forwarded a message on and then that reached other people that donated then then they've helped so excellent thanks to everybody that's amazing. Thank you, Tony. Uh, and we'll see you next season for the final forecast. And I think the new fixtures come out later this week. I better get studying then. <laughs> yeah, get your notebook out. No, and, I think uh, I better practice my goal first before the uh, studying on the football. Maybe you could do both at the same time. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, Sam, thank you so much. And if people are new to the channel and, and not seen one of your videos before and what's going on, could you tell them a little bit about Back of the Net and... What you got coming up? It's funny, I was just sort of looking through the stats really. And as a YouTube channel, we started in 2016, but um, we posted a few videos and then we took them off. So we were just sort of dormant really for you know a good three years or so. But August 2019, I spoke to Jeff Hay where I said, Look, I'm gonna try this YouTube thing and you know see how we go and just build some content because not least it'll engage other fans as well. Because with a podcast, you're either a Cherries fan or you're not. You're not a fan of any other club and you're thinking, I'm going to listen to a Bournemouth podcast. Whereas with YouTube, you can dip in and out. Mm. When YouTube, the subscriber numbers have gone up and and that I, th I think is a testament to you know, some of the characters that we have on, including yourself, Mr. Tiggs, and also Tony Funnel, but also some of the interviewees that we've had as well. And we managed to speak to some incredible people who have played in the game, like Matt Holland, you know, more ex-players like Tommy Elphick, Mark Pugh, Matt Ritchie, Brett Pittman, Steve Fletcher, Jan Kermigan, and also players of the past as well. You know, Keith Williams, um, we've had Willow, we've had Ian Thompson, Milton. I mean, w we could go on. I'm laughing because I'm thinking everyone's got to see the Tommy Heffernan video. <laughs> <laughs> and, and Tommy Heffernan. And he is, well, how outspoken was he? And... <laughs> If you want to watch all these videos, we've got an interviews uh, playlist card at the top of the screen. Um, so if you click that, that will show you all of the interviews. And one of the ones that stands out for me is someone that's going to be playing the round of golf uh, with Tony Funnel. Uh, and that's Harry Redknapp. 
And wow, what an interview that was. And, you know, like the game of golf, he, he'll he be there for a bit. He'll have some food and then he'll carry on. Mm -hmm. And uh, that was a two hour special with. And if you want to click the card at the top of the screen, you can watch that Harry Redknapp interview now. So, yeah, we're going to try to bring some more of that similar content along uh, over the next kind of season. You know, we are in the championship, but hopefully there'll be more of a thirst for AFC Bournemouth content. So do subscribe and, um, yeah, appreciate everyone's kind words and support over the last year because it's been great. And to to culminate the season, although it's been a dreadful season and one of our worst, to culminate it in something positive like this, mm. I think has been such a positive thing. It's been a positive focus. and It's almost numbed me a bit. It, you know, it's like been my sort of anaesthetic uh, for the season and I felt good doing this. And, hey, We've had, what, 2,000 YouTube subscribers. We've raised just over £2,000. Maybe we should just go for a pound a subscriber next season. So maybe we'll be on 4,000. I don't know. Maybe we can raise more for another charity. Who knows? But either way, it's been a really positive thing to do. And I just want to reiterate my thanks to everyone who has shared, uh, posted, but also donated as well. And especially to Chris Root. As you worked out, Mr. Tiggs, that how much did he put on? I think it was I think it was 20. I think it was 20 pounds. Wow. Fair, you know, that's £20 well spent, isn't it? Helping Incredible. an amazing charity and playing a round of golf with Harry Redknapp, but also this legend underneath. Yeah, and I don't think Chris needs to watch the Harry Redknapp video, does he? Because he's going to get it live. He's going to get all the stories, all the jokes live. Yeah, definitely. We'll have to, we'll have to see if we can get Chris to bring a camera with him or uh, or something. Get some, get some I'll photos. Have, I'll have my camera taking some pictures and videos. So. Brilliant. Thank you, Tony. Um, I mean, he'll have a great day to look back on for years. Mm, and he'll have a laugh watching me play, won't he, as well? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Superb. And, you know, we're just assuming that Chris plays golf himself. Um, so, you know, if he doesn't, maybe he'll be gifting it to someone else. But either way, it's his prize. And, uh, you know, with that and the rope and anchor, he'll be well fed. He'll be you know, watered at the rope and anchor. And he'll be able to open his bottle openers too, whilst spending some money on a new AFC Bournemouth shirt as well from the Superstore. So, well, yeah, great prize. Absolutely brilliant. And that pretty much brings us to the end of this video uh, and the end of our Funnel Forecast fundraiser. Hopefully we'll be doing something similar next year, as Sam said. Uh, but from all of us at Back of the Net, up the cherries. Back of the Net! Back of the Net!